Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, Sprouty here, and today I'm gonna talk about a trailer I saw, and you probably already know what it is. It's the Wolverine trailer. Uh, so I just got some comic books I'll show off. You know, cool Wolverine covers. Got Wolverine here, Hugh Jackman sort of looking cover. Kind of looks like Hugh Jackman. Uncanny X-Men issue 523. It's cool looking cover as well. And Wolverine Origins 57. Uh, I'll just keep it at this. Sort of like, yeah. Uh, there. There we go. Yeah, that looks good. Anyways, my thoughts on the trailer. Uh, it doesn't look bad, but it just, it doesn't look, doesn't look cool, you know? I'm not, like, super excited for the movie. Like, right now, I'm more excited for G.I. Joe than Wolverine. Because, I mean, it looks fine. I mean, it's, it's gonna, but it just, it looks like a C or a B level movie, one of those kinds of movies. Now, it's definitely gonna be better than, uh, Origins, you know. With a movie like that, you can really only go up. And if you go down, then Fox needs to get rid of the X-Men and stop making movies. So, that that's just my preference. <laughs> But what it's going to be about is it's going to be about Wolverine going to Japan. We already knew that because, you know, they want to do something new, something different. And let's face it, uh, the whole Sabretooth thing in Origins did not work. So let's try something else. And, you know, it was a story, you know, a, a time, I guess, that Wolverine was in Japan in the comic books. And he trained, and there was Silver Samurai, and in, I didn't... I'm not too big on X-Men, though. I don't read too many X-Men comic books. Um, I mean, it's alright, but I, I don't, I'm not a huge X-Men fanboy. I like X-Men. They're alright. I like them. I'm just not a huge fan of them. You know, I'm, I... I love X-Men, is what I'm trying to say. You know what I'm saying. I just... They're not my favorite superheroes. That's what I'm trying to say. But, anyways... So, he's going there, and... Forget that freaking... Uh, his teacher's name, Oku... Oh, what's it? So sort of an O. Oh, I don't want to look like a dumbass, so... And he's gonna teach Wolverine to be human again. So, I guess Wolverine loses his healing factor. Um... Oh, lo yeah, he get Because what we see in the trailer is he gets, like, shot and stabbed a couple times, and... You know, and he's bleeding, and he's coming more human. I don't know if that was in the comic books or not. Like I said, not too big on the X-Men. I'm... I don't think it was. It might have. It may have been. I just don't want to look like a dumbass. Um, I'll look it up later. But anyways, probably the coolest part for the trailer though for me is when the guy cut him in the face with glass and he said that. Oh, you know. I don't think he really did that, but I can imagine it like that. Anyways, my thoughts on the movie definitely does not look like it's the best superhero movie that's coming out this summer. And, uh, I mean, you know, what do you got? Movies like, uh, Iron Man 3, Man of Steel, what other movie does Marvel have? They got the Wolverine, oh shit, what other movie was there? Crap, I can't remember. <laughs> Damn it, okay, anyways, guys, I'm going on, anyways, uh, my thoughts on the trailer, it's alright.